Hey guys, we're going to talk about the very famous Foil Tomagoyf, the GP Vegas Top 8 Drafted Pack 2 Pick 1 with pretty much no playability in his deck, Tomagoyf. Uh, this Tomagoyf ended at $14,900 and you might be like, wait, didn't they have bids over 19000 Yes, they did, but those bids were not real as people who were, I mean, it's kind of ridiculous to me that they would do this, but this is what happened. People were making fake bids and then going on social media to say how awesome they were for promoting themselves with fake bids. I guess the bid isn't fake. Um, it's just that like when the you make a bid of $19,000 and no one bids above that, you get a little worried. So then you go ahead and you retract your bid, but you get all the attention. So all the attention seekers were making bids on this stores and online stores, things of that nature anyway. Still not bad. Still not bad. It's essentially a $15,000 Tamagoyf, half going to charity and half going to his pocket. Now the prize, I believe, for winning the GP top, for winning GP Vegas was $4,000. So the dude could have won both two different GPs and still not come out as well as he did money-wise. Now non-money-wise, the guy's just famous. Uh, there's no other way to say it. He did extremely well for himself. Um, he don't is going to donate to a great charity, and that's excellent. In my opinion, it really is excellent that this has happened, and good for him, really, truly. If you don't feel happy for him and happy for the MTG community, then I don't know what to say to you because this is amazing that, you know, first of all, 7500 will be donated to a great charity and that he is being paid 7500 for something that most players would regard, most players would say, hey, I would have done that. So good for him.